Hello, my spooky homies. Your girl, Brittany, here. And I know that Halloween is over, yes, unfortunately. And I didn't get to do as much as I really wanted to do. But that doesn't mean that I can't share what I received from Shanita, who is planned to play in my spooky pack swap that I hosted with my patrons over on my Patreon. So if you missed out on what I created for her, don't you worry. I'll have that video linked for you. And then, so I am so super excited. I haven't swapped in a while, so it's like, how do I do these things again? But this is the card that we had, and it says Happy Haunting. She had a cute little note in there, so I'm super excited. And she has this box of deliciousness. Long. I'm so excited. And she did participate in a group swap that I'm hosting with them as well. So I had to kind of dig that part out without showing you the group swap stuff because i still got to record that video but so i'm gonna start taking things out and we're gonna start getting things together okay all right stay tuned <music> All right, so these were this was the contents of what was in that box and i'm so excited so just a recap on what we're supposed to do we were supposed to create a backpack and you're to include four sets of two embellishments an edible treat a altered or handmade notebook with a pen and then um a crafty goodie that was like five bucks or so and um sequin mix yes yes and so uh, i just oh it's so cute this backpack is so cute okay so let me put things away so she has gifted some of these jolie's boutique stickers these are adorbs i love them i think i've gotten these before these are cute oh this these would have been so perfect with october 31st <gasps> i still have a bunch of that collection left so definitely saving that for next year and then we have these little pretty glitter stickers these are by sticko so that's uh target i believe right target's the only one who sells that or is it like a hallmark thing anyways let me i'm just babbling to myself we got ghosts and skull we got the little um headstone with the curl these are cute thank you so much for that my dear appreciate you and ooh, i'm so excited for this i already know what it is yummy oh and this is the teeny tiny little bow that was inside of her like packing mix i just had to have it out and show you guys Boop. all right so some ferrero rocher mm, delicious this is going in my little mini fridge so i can eat it during my times where I'm not sure what I'm going to do with my life and crafting. <laughs> so um, we'll get to the backpack shortly. I want to show everything else. So inside of this cute little box. Oh, board candy. Yes. Love it. We have some Twix and Milky Way. We have Snickers. We have m and m Yes, girl. Yes. She knows how to speak my, to my soul. And then I love this little zipper pouch. This is so cute. Oh, no, I love this. I want one. I mean, now I have one, but it's like, you know, I want more. I want more. So she has her altered notebook here. And she has these pens. You know, I was going to buy some of these pens and make some. But I have so many things going on in my life right now. I eat work. And I just didn't have the time. But these are, this is so cute. And I love this little spider web. Um um b that you have on there and she has the pink and then it comes with two extra little um ink pens so cute thank you so much for that and then this this is so cute that she used um the fairy tale club collection oh i can't remember which one it is but um this is so cute it says you are magic and she used the disbound rings and she has the pretty orange paper in there and look at that buffalo plaid you know she knows how to speak to my heart and then eek and then she has her little sticker here created by shanita at plan to play you can find her there on instagram and then we also y'all know I have my love for socks i can't i have so many of them and i wear them all and i love these <gasps> And one of my favorite things to gift are socks, but when I went to go shop for them, there was like none. And I don't like always getting stuff from Dollar Tree because, you know, everybody kind of sort of has everything from Dollar Tree. I couldn't find anything at Target. Like everybody snatched them up. 
and the only thing that were left were like kid sizes and it's like well i don't know if she has kid like feet so i ain't gonna worry about that <laughs> but this is too cute thank you so so much and then we're gonna go mm, let's go with the backpack i don't know what this is we're gonna go with the backpack look how adorable this is now she did say in her note that it was an svg file but she didn't scale it to be larger because she wasn't sure what she was gonna do and then she was like, then I got out of hand with embellishments. I was like, that's okay. You know, we do that. And I love how she did the faux stitching on there with the white um, gel marker. It says 31 October. She has enamel dots on there. Cute. I love it. And then inside, we have the embellies. Yay. And then her sequin mix, too. I love that she made a little box for it. Vampire Bat Elixir. Poison. Poison. Ooh, look at this delicious mix. Oh, that is amazing. I love it. I love sequin mixes. Oh, she has little um, silver moons. She has some little stars. She has that really pretty blue that helps really make it pop from the collection. Then she has black, pink, and orange. She has disgusting candy corn. <laughs> she has the... Um, orange and white swirls like these this i love this mix this is such a beautiful mix i love it and i am a design team member for the fairy tale club make sure you guys are sending your prayers over to andrea she is having a really hard time right now with her crypts um she did have a new collection that was coming out um i think they are still going to send it it is a halloween collection but things had just you know things she, things have just been in turmoil with her so make sure you send your prayers over to her poor poor thing i wish there's something i could do but um here is ooh, i wonder what this is you know the funny thing is too i was gonna use one of the collections but i didn't have enough of each of the collections to do the things i was gonna do so i was like ah oh, crud <laughs> so she has one of the frames here and it says boo she has a cute little enamel dot and then inside here we have it's a little folder for cute and then this is so cute it says magic with the little ghost and a uh, silver puffy star i haven't seen those which are cute and then she has the enamel dots on there adorable and then this one says witch's brew so it's like the little notebook. These are like the little notebooks, right? This is a, no, this way. <laughs> it is the notebooks. Okay. It threw me off a little bit. Okay. <laughs> and then again, the puppy stars. She has a little puppy bat there. These are too cute. I love these. And it's perfect because I still have this collection. So I have some embellishments for that. Awesome sauce. And then here she did the little bat wing bows. And she added a little bat there too. She added some little blings on the wings. So cute. And then here, ooh, she do some little library pockets. Oh, these are adorable. I like these. These are so cute. I love the little spider web here. And it says, boo. She has the little gray enamel dots. And it says, ghost check. <laughs> Thank you for haunting with us for funny. I love it. I fracking love it. And then this one here says, spellbound. <laughs> That's what it's called, spellbound. <laughs> <laughs> and then we have a um a cauldron bubbling we have a little spider web there and then here is another little ticket these are cute i love these little pockets i love them so simple so like but it's it you know just the things you do i tell you the things you do and then last but certainly not least you guys know i am a sucker for shaker I don't even think I made shakers this time because my life is um, hashtag chaotic. So I didn't even make any shakers. But I am loving these. They are thick. And I love it. And then she even has the impression in there. You see that in um, the acetate for the bat wings or the, for the bat body for cute. And I love this mix. You can have the black and white um little polka dots we have little ghosties we have some swirls orange yellow pink we have like some purple iridescence we have some sparklies i love it and then here is its little bat homie oh my goodness you're so cute love it love it for cute thank you so so much and then last but not least 
We have, look at this super cute clipboard. Oh yeah, we're supposed to do die cuts. That's what we're supposed to do. <laughs> we're supposed to do die cuts. And she made a cute little clipboard of these little skeleton people. Ah, I love it. I love it. There's a little clipboard. She has a little potion that says boo. Oh, I love this. And look at the little skeleton people. Well, there you go. And then this one's done with foam. Oh my goodness, I love it. And then here we have a little, um, um, not iridescent, but, um, 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 you guys know what I'm talking about. I, I'm not going to think anymore. I worked a long day. <laughs> my brain hurts. Bear with me. And we're not even in peak season yet, but it's coming. And then look at this cute little book that she did. It says Halloween and we have trick or treat. She did. Um, the little banner ruffles. I want to say, is this the one? Is this the Coco Arena? For cute. And I love the little orange doily. Oh, I love this little fabric piece here. The pumpkins. Oh, cute. The little details, I tell you. And she has the white enamel dots. And then we open her up. And, <clears throat> ah, something keeps sticking to my arm. So, in this first one, she added a little pocket from Target. And we have... Well, we have little creepy spiders here. You know, you know, they look a little too real for my liking. We're, dude, I was at, I went to a mailbox today. And as soon as I was about to open it up, I saw a ginormous spider crawl up to it. And it was like by the handle. I was like, nope, uh, you're not getting your mail today. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry, but I was, I wasn't gonna, I wasn't. I'm not with that tomfoolery. <laughs> that was, it was scary. But look, we have these little frames of the little webs. These are cute. I haven't seen this die before. And then here we have some little bats in a circle. We have them in glitter. And then we have one in orange. We got a little witch's hat. And then we have some little haunted houses. Oh, there's another witch's hat. And she even added the little... Um, Tram on there. You go, girl. All that paper piecing. I can't. And then we yeah, have the little we just have. I could already build a scene with just the uh, die cuts that you gifted, girl. Okay. I ain't mad at you. I'm gonna do it just like this because I ain't got time to put it back in plastic baggies. <laughs> and then over here we have some little bats around a spider web. Cute. I haven't seen this before either. Did you use your machine for these? Because I have not seen these before. These are cute. I actually used dies for her die cuts. I actually used dies for her die cuts, and I'm so proud of myself. <laughs> and then, ooh, these are borders, I want to say. Ooh, oh, oh, oh. Things are falling out. <laughs> Wasn't expecting that. So we have a little spider web here. We have ghosties. And then we have um, some bats. We have skulls. And then, oh my goodness. And then look at all these little teeny tiny pieces. Oh my gosh, do these, so do these get like put on here? Get out. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, I see you. I see you. Okay. That's what's up. That's what's up. Oh, and this one had, this one was stuck on there, but I don't think it goes like on all of them. Now I got to make sure I find all my pieces and don't lose them because they all just kind of came out on me. This is cute. And then we have like this little funky border here. These are cool. I like these. I like those. And then here we have, looks like some witches hats and tombstones. I am loving the colors. Definitely so. Look at that one. And then we have the witch hat. We have a couple tombstones. We have glitter witch hat. And then we got these little picket fences. <laughs> I love the little detail that's in there. Those are super cute. Super, super cute. 
I love it. Like, dude, I am like almost like I'll say, like I said, I, I said this um in another video that I love receiving die cuts because I am not really a person who will just sit down and die cut. Um, I am a person who likes to just put the things together. Like, uh, you know, I just want, oh, look at this one. It's cute. They are supposed to be like a bones. <laughs> um, I, I like to just go ahead and put it all together. I don't want to sit down and do the die cutting because I feel like it's such a tedious task. And it's like, if I need to die cut something, I'll die cut it because I need it for that project but I am trying to get better of like kind of like preparing and prepping and stuff but sometimes it's hard too because I'm not I don't usually just work with one collection that's the thing I have so many collections that I want to utilize them some way or another and use it up and so like it's hard for me to truly prep for you know something because I want I'm gonna try to use it all and you know I can't use pastel with traditional and vice versa that's just a no-no <laughs> and then here oh what is what what are we doing <gasps> is this one of those nasty candy corns is this build a nasty candy corn it is build a nasty candy corn you guys know how I absolutely can't stand candy corn so I'm always gonna call it nasty I'll craft with it but they're they're still disgusting <laughs> and look Dun, da, da, da. We got a candy corn. Ta da! Cute. I love it. I love it. You know, I don't have any candy corn dyes. Well, I usually don't use it like that because, you know, candy corn is disgusting. But, you know, I shouldn't be like that. It's not like I'm eating it. I'm just crafting with it. You know what I mean? I shouldn't be hurting its feelings like that. Being mean and stuff. This book is so cute. And then she has a little bow right here. And it says, Happy Halloween. She got the enamel dots. I know I didn't really go through the book. So I'm trying to go through it now. And show you guys what she did. But really, really cute. And it's very simple. and But it makes a statement. And I love it. Absolutely love it. You did an amazing job. Thank you so, so much for being my swap partner. Thank you so much for doing fabulous work fabulous work and ooh, wait there's a pocket is there anything in here Ooh, secrets <laughs> that was a good thing i noticed that i'm like hold on there's a pocket and so this is like a candy corn mix there's orange booze in there and then it's um orange yellow and white and there's little candy corn pieces oh look at these cute square ones with the stars on it <gasps> i love it those are so cute and then she has some um, diamond, white diamond dots in there. Love. You're amazing. Thank you so, so much for swapping with me. Thank you for all the fun goodies. Thank you, especially for the candy. And you did fantastic work, guys. I'll have her link down below where you can go show your love to her over on the gram. Hopefully, one day she'll go ahead and start up her YouTube. Who knows? But regardless, thank you so much for hanging out. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. I am still trying to reach my goal of 3K before the end of the year, which is right around the corner. I would truly appreciate your love and support. And subscribe if you're not a subscriber hello to all my new friends hello to all my old ones and let's continue on on this crafting chaos that i call myself and you have a amazing day until next time bye